Lifeguards are warning beachgoers, be careful. Earlier today, some surfers helped rescue this Maryland girl who said she got caught in a rip current. Ten on your side's Melanie Woodrow is live at the oceanfront now. And what are you hearing today, Melanie? Well, Tom, there are a lot of people out here, and all of them have been saying that the current is really strong, strong enough to make you lose your balance or worse. As the holiday weekend comes to an end, beach season is just beginning. All the storms they've got popping in and out around the East Coast right now, we know we're going to see. We're in for a lot of adventure this summer, I think. Lifeguard one to a supervisor up north. Tom Gill, deputy chief of Virginia Beach Life Saving Life Service, says lifeguards have already made more than 30 rescues since Friday. Adriana Carranza is not surprised. From our hotel, it seemed it was like it was calm, but now once you're actually out, it, it's strong. <laughs> you have to really be careful not to lose your balance. Which is why Bill Brinkley says he didn't go out as far as he'd like. I mean, I'm very respectful of the riptides, so I'm not going to go out more than 30 feet. Even at 30 feet, Brinkley said he felt it. It's pretty strong. Yeah, it's pretty strong. I just banged my knee. Gill wants beachgoers to know after 6 p.m. the number of lifeguard stations drops dramatically. People really need to understand that level of preventative life saving, 41 staff stands to 10 staff stands, that's a big drop in numbers. He suggests people hit the boardwalk and restaurants after 6 and save the beach for another day. Every day has its challenges. And beach officials are warning visitors about much more than water safety. Coming up tonight, New at 6, we'll let you know what their other big warning is for the summer season. Reporting live in Virginia Beach, Melanie Woodruff, 10 on your side.